Hello! Today we'll be going over eduaid.ai, which is an AI education tool that teachers can use to save them some time and help them produce resources. So up here, this is the um, page that will open when you open the AI website. Up here you can change the subject that you are going to be creating resources for and the grade level. So I'm going to change it to fourth grade because I'm more familiar with that um, type of stuff. And then at here, as you can see, there's a bunch of different generators that you can use, such as unit plans, learning objectives, lesson plans, etc. Over here, you can change the tool that you're using. There's also assistant stuff, um, so it can create substitute plans, classroom announcements, email outlines, etc. And then you can also use it to help give students feedback. So right here you can um, insert student papers, student essays, and it will give them feedback. You can chat. Unfortunately, this is a tool that is only available to pro users, which you have to pay for. And then there's also an assessment builder. So here I'll just demonstrate a couple different things in each. So the unit plan I thought was super interesting. So down here you can enter a standard or even just an idea or topic. So let's say the water cycle. You can enhance it um, to be a little bit more specific. So students will be able to explain the process of the water cycle, including ev evaporation, condensation, and precipitation. And then when you click add, add to workspace, over here, you will see the unit plan that EduAid created. So it created five lessons and um, assessment measures for you to use and then a conclusion of what the students should be able to do by the end of the unit. Let's do this lesson seed and we can do the same topic and then over here it's creating a lesson seed. So just some different activities that you can use, assignments, formative assessments, so EduAid would have been very helpful in my sixth grade classroom where I had students at differing levels and I needed to have content or activities that were more aligned to their levels. And so having the opportunity, instead of just racking my brain for something new, I could go in, I could say I need an activity at this grade level and it would give it to me. And so for me, it also offers sub plans, which I really, really like. I missed that part. And at the top of all of these, you can edit them, you can copy and paste them. So you can edit them to be a little bit better fitting for your students. Over here for, let's do this substitute planner. So let's just say like whole day of lessons. So here you can see substitute teacher plan. And again, this one you would probably definitely want to edit and just um, you can change the time and you can make it a little bit more specific for yourself and your classroom but this gives you a good little breakdown and then let's do the assessment builder and then let's do fractions you can choose different types of assessments and here are it comes up with some examples all right, so that was a brief demonstration of how to use EduAid. Thank you for watching.